Hey friends, Kitty, and welcome back to my channel. So, so today's video is going to be just chit chat granny me. I feel like I haven't talked and sat down for a wicked long time, so I'm here to bring your chit chat granny me. I already have my foundation on because I am doing a first impression, but other than that, we're just gonna chat and get ready. And I'm super excited about it, so yeah, let's just get right to it. So I think I'm gonna try a concealer today, like a new one, and I'm super excited about that. I think I've tried this in the past, but I literally don't remember my thoughts on it. This is the Naked Skin Concealer. They gave me a light, warm, medium, light and and dark which dark will not work but I think I'm gonna try light for under my eyes and then I could possibly use medium light on my face we'll see I'm just gonna take my sponge and yeah I'm super excited to be chatting with you today because we haven't chatted in literally ages and ages it's been a hot minute since we've been able to chat they literally don't give you that much concealer like what the heck I like this shade though and usually I'm like a neutral girl so the fact that this warm concealer is something that I'm loving is nice. I really like how light it is. But yeah, we haven't chatted in literally ages. I think the last time I probably filmed a chit chat to me was like summer. Oh my god, it's insane. Yeah, this one is even too too dark. I'm not even gonna play with that. Yeah, so this is nice, but it's not giving me my, my full coverage, or at least my coverage that I'm used to. So hopefully my concealer is in here somewhere. I hate living out of a makeup bag as you may or may may not already know i'm just gonna take my cachise liquid camouflage which i like but i've been using this recently and it's not like a love love but i do like it i don't know like what to say about it like i just i'm i was using tarte shape tape for a while and then i went to the makeup revolution and now we're here and i just i don't know how i feel about it like it doesn't give me like the full coverage that I always want and stuff, but I do really like it and stuff. I don't know if I'd repurchase. I feel like I'm almost filming an empties video right now because I'm being like, I don't know if I'd repurchase, blah, blah, blah. It's the YouTuber me. And yeah, so I don't even know what to update you on. I just went through midterms week and it was complete hell, complete shit show basically. It was just a lot and I don't even know if I did good on all my midterms and stuff, but still that's fun and just school is just interesting and everything. I actually don't really like all my classes. Some of my classes I like. Some of them I'm just like, oh my god, why am I in this class? It's a little terrible, but you know, you get to a certain place and then you get everywhere and then you get to where you want to be. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, but yeah, uh, it's just a pain and I just am not about it. You know, like I'm just, I want to be in a different place and I'm just not there. I don't know like what that like entails, but you know, I didn't really have high expectations for starting school back up again. Like I literally didn't. So uh, I don't even know what to like say or what to be like. Be like, oh yeah. Like I was a little worried about my living situation when I started school because I was living with um just a bunch of people I didn't know. Which yeah, Katie, that's college. But like I ended up somewhere where people like they had certain roommates that they wanted to live with, and I guess that didn't work out like I just ended up there but I ended up working out I really like the girls that I live with it's like five of us five of us including myself so six of us so we have three double rooms and everything so like everyone shares a room it's not like one person doesn't share a room or two people don't share a room so we have double rooms and then we also have like a little bit of a living area and a bathroom and everything that has a shower two sinks and then like a stall for the toilet because there's literally no lock in our bathroom door so it's not like you walk in there's a toilet shower sink it's just I think they did that so that way like somebody could be showering or going to the bathroom at the same time or they could be using the sink and showering at the same time which i guess is smart but it's also annoying because sometimes you just want your alone time in the bathroom you don't want people walking in like i know the one of the one of the first times i showered somebody like, walked in while i was showering and i was just like can you leave so i can get out of the shower like it was just just i don't know it was weird and i tried to just sit under my eyes with that but yeah school will it'll get there i don't know if i'll get like where i want to be after this semester but we'll see what happens i just want to finish school i've been in school for too long too long like it took me five semesters five semesters to finish a two-year degree then i took a semester off to and then I transferred and I just want to get to the point where I'm like graduating. I technically, if 
we're going by the stands of society. I should already be graduated from college. But you know, life happens. Not everything works perfectly in a perfect straight line. And that's okay. Like there's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing, well, I can try and finish school faster, but it's impossible. Like there's not only much I can do about it. Like we kind of just have to roll with the punches. Oh my God, the lighting is coming out. I'm so happy. Why didn't I just start filming now? I don't even know what I want to do for my eye look today. I don't know. But I've missed like filming so much. Like you don't like realize how much you miss filming when you're not filming every day. Cause I used to film like pretty much every day for my channel and I miss it so much. So my goal is this weekend is to film as much as I can film as many videos as I can so I have videos to edit because I actually miss editing like so that way on the weekends I can edit the video or a video like it's kind of insane how much I miss and I will be filming my birthday haul which will probably already be up by now of me talking to you about it but I'm super excited okay these were actually gonna be in my birthday haul. You've probably already seen it because I do want to get that video up like right away. So I'm gonna finish filming this and then I'm gonna film that. Super excited, super, super excited. I have no idea what palette to use. I got I got the Norvina palette, which you saw a get ready me um, for my birthday with this palette. But I also got the soft glam palette, which I really, really like. I might film like another one of those like old school type get ready me as while I'm home just cause that's an easy video to edit cause you just like fast forward it, put on um, music and stuff, which I I really do enjoy. I love the editing style of those type of videos. I think I'm gonna mix these two palettes now that I think of it because I really want to use like rose gold in this palette but I also really want to use some colors in here so I think I'm just gonna mix the two together. Okay here we go. I just primed. My brushes are actually all over there so I probably should go get those but I'll just set real quick. Okay so first I'm just take tempura. This is like the typical white kind of base shade. I usually like to this on my lids and our corners and this just adds a good base for my eyes which is always nice so I just like to take this and put it on uh, my lid all the way up to my brow bone. Okay, I'm gonna go get my other brushes. So I'm gonna use my Morphe M441. I do wanna get more Morphe brushes, but we just haven't got there yet. So I think I'm gonna take orange soda and burnt burnt orange. I really like the combination of these two colors. I just think they're like the perfect transition for my eyes. Let's see, what else can I talk about? It's like, I always say I have like lots to talk about, but once I get to like filming process and when I start filming, I forget everything I wanna talk about, which I've been thinking a lot of like things to talk about all week. Like not even like on purpose, but like I just have like so many thoughts and just so many thoughts married dating in my brain I just lost all of them like right here right now yeah okay, I'm not really sure I think I should like build it up so I think I'm gonna take incense that's what it what it's called? I think so. Yeah, my nose just looks wicked splotchy on the tip. I don't know why, but it does. <laughs> Hopefully you can just take my sponge and make it better. I love both of these palettes. I'm kind of like not sure how I feel about the Sultry palette. I think I'm gonna wait until reviews roll around to purchase that one because I honestly don't know. Like I like the looks of the palette, but there's also colors in there that I know I wouldn't use. Which that's any palette. You're not gonna use every color in a palette. Like pretty much you're probably not gonna use every color in a palette. So it's kind of like hard, you know? There's just so much out there. It it's hard to like be like, yeah, I'm gonna use this. It's most likely you're not. So now I'm gonna take my, some type of BH Cosmetics brush. I have no idea what this is because I've washed it so many times. So literally the numbering comes off. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna take Sienna and Rustic and mix those two together. Yeah, I love both of these palettes. People say the soft glam is boring, but I love the looks of it. Like it's literally so gorgeous. And actually when I got it at Ulta, the girl that was um, checking me out on the register, she said that like I was buying two of her favorite palettes. So I was like, okay, this, this, is, this means it's meant to be. This is 
fate just like just coming at me and being like yes katie you need this palette in your life like she was like basically giving that to me which i i live for that kind of stuff like it's awesome when like you go to buy something and they're like oh i love that palette like you're gonna love it and i'm like yes okay so now i want to go into rose gold i'm super excited i also kind of want to play with wild child but i think i'm gonna save that for a different day but yeah we're gonna go into rose gold i'm gonna actually use anastasia brush because i really like the double endedness of this so i'm just gonna take a few little dips in this i've never used this before it's like a glitter type shade i'm assuming just because of all that ness i'm gonna tap it off a little bit and go right in my lid Ooh, that is so pigmented pretty pigmented i think these shades like have a hard time like sticking so it's like hard to like get them to go like how you want them but it'll work it'll work it'll be fine love i might like spray my brush in a second do you like because that's what i did when i like filmed the get ready me for the norvina i like sprayed my brush because i just felt like it needed a little like almost like a kick or a punch to get it to be like a little bit more so i'm gonna just do that spray my brush and i'm just gonna go like on the inner corner I make it pigmented, super pigmented there, and then just blend it to the center. I really like this color. I think it's super gorgeous. I just want that pigmentation to be like right in that inner part of my eye. Ooh, yes, love. Okay, so I'm just gonna take incense again and just blend out the crease. And I'm just gonna blend that. I really like the, I like how it's pink like rose gold, but it's not like super pink, you know what I mean? And I think I wanna take passion, kind of give it like a cranberry-esque to it, which I really like. Taking this brush again and going with passion, I'm only gonna dip it in like twice and then tap off my brush. And I'm just gonna be going into that very outer. And this I feel like will just give it like a cranberry smoke to it. I really like that. Taking Vault Tail too just to give it like a little bit of a deep end to that outer corner outer crease Ooh, i am living for that okay so that's the eyes i'm really loving how they are looking just gonna take a little tad bit more of rose gold to just tap on the inner part of my lid i love using my fingers for eyeshadow i do that a lot and yeah that's that's a look I love. Okay, so next, I'm just like real quick, just gonna take Dreamer and I'm just gonna pop this on to the inner corners. It's like a step I always forget. So I wanna get like right out of the way. So I'm just gonna pop that in my inner corners with my finger and then I'm gonna take whatever's left and put it under my brow. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take my brow job real quick and I'm just going to apply it through my brows real quick. I really love my essence. I think I might pick up another one because this one is just, it's like running out. So I need like more of it, which I love this brow gel. So yes, I mean, it lasts a wicked long time. So that's good. Okay. So next I'm just going to take my Tarte Pro Glow Palette and I'm just going to apply the contour on this palette. I really, really, really like it. So I'm going to take my contour brush and just take the sculpt in that palette and chisel everything out. I like never contour on a daily basis and I do want to do a video, which I might film Tuesday. Like I might film two looks on one day and just like remove my makeup before the first one. But I kind of want to do like a video on my everyday like lazy makeup because for class I usually don't like wear much. I don't contour. I literally just do foundation, concealer, like a light layer, brows. Um, I use like this contour in my crease and then I will do like a shimmery highlight highlight on my lid. I do that. I kind of just want a soft blush today. So where is it? There it is. I typically... So yeah, well, then I pretty much only like, I do, I do blush. I haven't been wearing highlight too much. Usually I'll use like a blush that already has like a highlight infused into it because it like gives my cheeks a glow. I love this blush like so much. Not only does it smell good, I don't know. Okay, I can't find my other mascara. I just saw it, so I'm just gonna use my Sephora Lash Craft Big Volume Mascara. And yeah, I actually really like this mascara and everything. I've been trying to use up my mascaras, so it's like hard to like, 
like try new ones and stuff. So if I get like high mascara, which I think this came in my mom's Sephora play. But like if I buy high high end mascara, it's definitely sample just because I have so many mascaras. I think I only have one full size in like my stock and stuff. I think that's all I have left. That's too much having like three or four and I just used up one full size. I don't know if I'm filming an empties video while I'm home, but if not, I'll film it the next time I'm home. I like this mascara too, but it's just super wet and everything. I do have some like on my lid, a tiny bit, but we'll get to that. I think I'm just gonna use a little bit of the roller lash. Like this one's getting super clumpy because it's old or it's getting there at least. I'm just gonna apply a little bit of this. Okay, and highlight. I think I'm gonna go for the Pixi and Aspen Santorini Sunset highlight. I have no idea what happened to this highlight, but like part of it is like shaved off, which is super, super sad, but it's not like it's dead or anything. So we're good. Again, I feel like I always do this where like I don't talk about much in the video and I say I have so much to talk about but like literally I don't even know like I can't like sometimes like I'm just like eh? I don't have anything to say like what are you talking about I don't know there's like a lot I don't know do that but I'm gonna use this bite beauty Sephora birthday gift set that I have I haven't used this much because I'd have to put the lipsticks back into the packaging because I haven't filmed the birthday haul yet which I'm gonna film like right after this video just have to like update on my thingy so this one is chai and this is just their like mouge bouge lipstick and I kind I kind of want to go for this today, so I'm gonna see. Ooh, this is such a pretty color. I don't know if it actually goes with the vibe I'm going for today, but I really like this color, like a lot. Ooh, that's fun. Okay, so this is my makeup today. I feel like this is just the look and I love it. I loved getting ready for you, even though I didn't chat super well. I talked about like a couple things and next time I film one of these, I'll be sure to like actually write down a list of what I have to talk about. I feel like it was just a long video as is. I feel like I did talk about a decent amount of things. So yeah, and we got ready. So that's all that matters. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this little get ready me chatty style type video. I definitely enjoyed filming it. So yeah, be sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below what's going on in your life. I feel like I gave you a little bit of a life update, like a mini life update here. So yeah, definitely know what's going on in your life down below. And just any videos that you see next for me, let me know down below. I will be filming again very soon. I know like it's sporadic the times I'm filming, but the next time I will be home, I believe is for Thanksgiving. So I will definitely be filming again then. So if you have any video ideas, just leave them down below. And yeah, please subscribe if you haven't already because I post videos every single week. I try to post Mondays and Fridays with my school schedule. But we might be moving to just Fridays. Um, we'll see what happens. We'll see if I can keep up the Monday and Friday uploading. It's just school's getting to the point where it's getting crazy. It's been crazy since week two, so it's been hard. But we'll see if it gets better and maybe I will be able to film more. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, so please subscribe if you haven't already and also hit the notification bell down below if you want to be notified because it's always good to get the notifications. I love getting those notifications from the people I love watching. So definitely hit the notification bell as well down below. And yeah, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Video. Bye!